Sure. James's yeah. Achilles heel, as he said, is, uh, he's mentioned this himself that he kind of tends to lose interest in stuff when he gets to the end of bracket. So he'll do something. <laughs> what? Yeah, he'll that's just when like, it gets interesting. Yeah, that's Are you kidding me? He, yeah, like he. What if we it. were like that? We were like, you know what, top eight? Who cares? Let's go back to pools <laughs> round. I'm gonna balls. wear sweatpants <laughs> on my arms. What is wrong with him? <laughs> Man, God. what happened to all the me gunners out yes. there? Nonetheless, hey, I played a me gunner today. That was fun. Let's go. That's a winning. That's a yeah. He's you good. sure about that? <laughs> that was a, dude, it was a good matchup for Richter and Simon. So I don't care. Go ahead, can't be. We we'll do it back. We ain't anyway. looking at those characters right now. We got Mario, we got Krom, and we're already in the midst of a Wizzy clip. This man's never stopping with those up there. Yeah, dude, and Battlefield, just a perfect stage for him to extend combos, but let's see. Now we got James with the ledge, man. Jab and forward tilt, just monsters with the ledge. Covers so many options, dude. Krom can convert off the jab, yeah. too. It's nuts. And James is Good a trade. lab and Jab James is a lab monster Ooh. when it comes to converting on the ledge. And that was a really smart cape there. It's brave, dude. Yeah. If, if James shielded that, I'm pretty sure it was a forward smash or at very least a forward tilt. Like, <laughs> These young is... kids don't fear anything, man. Perry? Oh, <laughs> come on, man. <laughs> He's really it? swinging, though. Swanging. You gotta give Swanging. him credit for it though. Like, he's gonna get nice. so much off of landing one of these smash attacks. So much stage control, if anything, even the stock. Like, he's got nothing to lose. So continuing to press though. James has done what a good job bringing us back. That could be, that could have been a, a raw back, back air. air yeah. you know? that, that's a smooth stuff. But forward tilt, I swear to God, it's the best option of covering the ledge in the game. Like, Crown's forward tilt is just, it's, does everything, dude. It's so good. Yeah, he kind of juts himself forward a little bit farther than Roy does. But the down air, once, you know, still a great combo tool for Mario, but now also a killing tool at high percent. So oh Wizzy strikes God. first, and James, cloud on crack with yeah. those double up airs. I'm saying, too, like, we were talking about how good the platforms are for Wizzy's combos, but James, he sees those platforms in the same way, man. That was smooth. They're just so strong at being able to allow more anti-air play. And yeah, Dark is going to be able to get his combo chains off them. And he's going to get plenty of damage off it. But if he's not strong with where he's going to land, if he doesn't have good decision making, where he's going to put Mario after he's done, he's catching just as much damage, possibly even more. Because James is going to constantly bring him back and forth from ledge to ledge. Yeah, and James is doing a great job converting off of these up airs. Wizzy, I finally able to find respite. But now a little bit of a duel on the platform. And now Wizzy right back into the blender of the ledge, guys. Yeah, we're gonna see him living here for a second here. Oh, missing the grab. Hold on. All right. James little center stage. Oh, he just ran away and gave it up. All right, fair enough. Whatever, man. You got it. <laughs> He's a top eight. We're not. Exactly. I'm saying. So. Winner side too. Three of the buzz. There we go. James jab. Another nair too. That raw back here. Maybe he's maybe he's trying to keep it fresh for when he's ready to KO. Which could be right about now. Yeah, he swung with it there. So let's see. yeah, if there's one thing that James is really good at, he's really good at like saving his trump cards for like the very end of a, a set when it matters. Yeah. So you're gonna see him obviously go for those jab uh, nares now. Maybe low wolf Wizzy. There it is. And then yeah. a false insecurity, like I said, with the back air. So now James, after going down, you know, a little bit early, has now kind of right of the ship. Now finds himself back on top and continuing to press. Something that we like neglected to talk about was, dude, Mario suffers against swords so hard. Like, yeah, off stage, off stage, obviously, is like pretty, pretty decent for Mario. He has a lot of good tools off stage, but man, the neutral is just rough for Wizzy, especially. Krom is so fast in the air too; it's just tough, man. But here we go, Wizzy, the opportunity, the back throw, gonna set him up for a ledge guard trap. Anything? Nope. <laughs> he's out. He's man, out. It's yeah. hard because you see how good James's movement yeah. is. So good at saving his jump, and even at that. Krom is pretty solid air momentum as it is, so right. you know James is going to be able to choose really well how he's going to move around Wizzy, but what? Wizzy's just wow. as cool. Look how smooth this man's moving. Someone check the game. I'm yeah. pretty sure that's <laughs> sure Smash 4. Look for Wii U. There Never we mind. go. You're not seeing that in Wii U. I forget. That is, I know that one of... I, I know Krom has a different name up B than Roy does, but is this neutral B still the same it's name? A, I'll end you. Oh, sorry. That was the wrong one. Neutral B? I don't think it's called Eruption, is it? No, it's, it's not Eruption. It can't yeah, be. I forget what Roy's is called, to be completely honest with it's you. I don't remember. Are it's you sure? Are no, you? that's Ike's. It's a big boom. Oh, that is Ike's. <laughs> oh, you're serious. I don't play Fire Emblem. <laughs> I do not play Fire Emblem. I don't deal with Fire Emblem. I play Final Fantasy Tactics for the PlayStation slash PSP slash my mobile device, and that's it. Listen, all I know is the side B is double edge slash. Double edge double dance. Double edge dance, dance. Yeah. Yeah. Amateur. We Come don't on. know anything out We're here. We're voting you off the island. Man. <laughs> Nonetheless, though. James coming out on top, and I'm glad you guys mentioned the movement aspect of what James is able to bring to the table. Because that's always been one of the things he's best at. He's studies moving in his, in, you know, whether it be with Smash 4, Diddy Kong, or Krom in this game. He's just so fluid with his movement. Uh -oh. Wizzy does not give a hoot! Oh, okay. He just he disappeared. I wasn't sure what was going to happen. Couldn't he have done another rising up either? Maybe. Maybe. I don't he know if he had it. Yeah, I have no oh, idea. Good, man. I think Wait. it's important that he didn't go for it, though, because it's just another aspect of Woo! what's good with Dark Lizzie's mindset. Not overextending on a player like James is so important, because he can't really afford to give that up. He's already got good damage on board early on, but look what James has managed to do. He's tied that up regardless of how strong of a start Wizzy had, and That's now, right, yeah. with a quick nair, James is already cementing a lead. 
Yeah, Wizzy had the directional air dodge there, bring drip towards the stage, so James was like, all right, this is a layup. I'm going to come at you right now. Yeah, that was pretty much just shooting free throws in the gym at that point. So Wizzy has yep. a good amount of damage on the border here, but I think that's kind of the a big thing for Mario. As uh, You're going to see a lot of that... Um, that soaring slash out of shield from James, where that does 26%. It's a really good get off me option. The scary thing is, if Wizzy shields it though, he has blood ready to go. He can just blast him off the stage. Like, yeah, that, that water pressure is serious from that thing. Yeah. So. <laughs> We're not like that Seinfeld episode when they're in the hotel. That's what I'm talking <laughs> Right, that's what I was going to say. <laughs> no, but you see James air dodging to the ledge because he, he respected the full water pack. Oh, hold on. Yeah, that's you just got it. Like, yeah. you're, you're air dodging the ledge. Like, that's your option, basically. You want, if you want B, it's over. Dark Wizzy, definitely going to hit that every day of the week. It's the tragedy of Mario and Swords. You have to respect the damage you're going to take. You're going to have to respect all that stage control James is going to get. Uh -oh. And James knows that full and well. He's going to take advantage of Wizzy oh! every opportunity he gets. What a call out there. And now look at this. James chilling with the stock lead that he's got. Only 26%. All that after a jab neutral I was going to say, dude, well, he got, it was a whip up B, and then he went with the easy combo, we went jab nair, and then he got forward smash after. It was dope. He didn't try, like you said, he didn't try anything crazy. He got heavily rewarded for it. I like it. Sometimes playing to the book is just yeah. the best option for you, man. I feel like especially if you're the crom in this matchup, that's what you got to do. There's no reason to go crazy, you know? Yeah. Just, play, just play the matchup correctly, and at the end of the day, you should pretty much be winning. Yeah, don't go crazy, don't go stupid. But don't, don't go crazy stupid. <laughs> Down throw? Okay. Oh, God. Yeah, poor Wizzy having a rough time getting off this platform right now. As James is, is slowly starting to slip away from him. This is definitely the tough thing about Mario in this meta, man. There's so many good sword characters. Like, it's just, you gotta play so well against them. You know, play against a competent swordy, Lucina, Krom, Roy, even Roy, like, who's more of a brawler swordy. It's like, man, you gotta respect him. The issue lies in the fact that Wizzy's fantastic at getting his damage. We've seen that multiple times in the set alone. But ending up the stock is so much that he has to risk just to get in, just to get that opportunity. Whereas other characters, they're going to get their damage through their tit for tats, their trades. They're going to secure their stage control. They don't have to worry as much. Especially a character like Krom. What's he got to worry? He brings down the sword, and just like that, the 2 0. James is chilling when it comes to the kill. Did you see Wizzy's reaction about yeah. that? Yeah. <laughs> he felt. Because when Mario gets hurt, he gets hurt. He's like a stand. Yeah. Did I just make an anime <laughs> reference? Did I do that? That's a K pop reference. Is that, that a, a JoJo's stand? reference? That's a JoJo's, yeah. Is it? Yeah. I'm so wait, proud of wait you isn't guys. that isn't that like a meta joke where if you make a JoJo's reference, people are like everything's like JoJo's? I did it, dude. I'm I did so it. proud of you. This is it. I'm getting a picture taken of me making an anime reference. A, a degenerate like the rest of us. I always knew you had it. Everything video. makes me so upset. <laughs> it's just way, dude. Oh gotta, no! Does that make you upset? No way. No. I, I don't think say. I don't think Wizzy's allowed to pick another. That character. would have the darkest timeline. The if dark, he picked, darkest, not just another darkest character, Wizzy but timeline. Sonic. Darkest Wizzy. <laughs> darkest Wizzy timeline. People <laughs> trudging through the the depths of Twitter, looking for all that Sonic hate from ages old. All right, man. You got Wizzy. He's got his hat down. He's cross town. He's living like a rock star. <laughs> 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 There we go. We're here on Smashville as the musical stylings of KK Slider will uh, grace us into maybe a 3-0 for James or Wizzy getting himself back on the board here. So what do you guys think of the change of scenery here for Wizzy? I'll say I'm sorry. I had to get that one out because I'm pretty sure he's the only one in top eight wearing a hat. So I had to, you know, I had to get that one. It has. You think Slider takes requests? Oh, dude, if he does, I got, I got one for him. <laughs> Alexa, play KK Slider plays Old Town Road. Oh, hold on. Wow, nice. I love that fair over the ledge. That's so smart, but James got to recover the air dodge. Look at Krom, man. The drip is so good. He's still at... Yeah, that's it. Yeah, yeah. yep, yep, yep. That one thing we've been talking about the entire set finally rears its ugly head in uh, in game three. So Izzy gets himself on the board here, but the jab, the forward smash connects God. for James. There's no way that's true. No, nah, that looked fake as hell, but I think it's just a matter of... Got the jab, turn around, a little bit of spacing. It's just a call out on where Wizzy's gonna place himself. It's funny, man, because it's real enough, you know what I'm saying? It took the stop. Yeah. Like, like say, you know, say what you will, if it was a true combo or not, but James had the read, so. It's like a fairy tale. You can't prove it, but that's not gonna make it any less real. <laughs> you can't believe it. It's, it's like one of Aesop's fables or something. Yeah. I don't know. So are we switching genres to Taylor Swift now? I got it. <laughs> Today was a fairy. Never mind. Anyway. <laughs> Uh, you know, this, this, I actually like this counter pick for Mario a lot. He's Wizzy, yesterday I was talking to him, he's been talking a lot of smack about how good Mario's forward smash is. And, you know, it really hasn't made too many uh, guest appearances throughout this episode. Yeah, he's he's kind of whiffed the couple times he's done it, but now has himself back in the blender here. Ooh, but great uh, trap right there with the up smash, catching that landing from James. That's what I'm talking about with the flood. You don't necessarily need to use it at the ledge. Like, you can just put him in an awkward spot. James blew his jump, and then Wizzy tried to come through and, and hit him harder and put him in worse spots. So that was just smart. Yeah, That's Wizzy's it. use of new, of flood is just straight up in neutral has been very, very uh, crafty. Because it just resets the situation, worst case scenario. Like, yeah. nobody's going to be able to challenge it. You're just going to get blown back. But James continuing to fire right now. Both these guys are swinging on shields. 
Oh, I mean, the might as well, man. From Wizzy, oh we're seeing God. a lot of that top shelf vintage, the up smash coming out a lot in this matchup. And no, I, I think it's a good option because it's anti airing, but like, he's not doing anything about how well James is constantly pressing it out. Wizzy's just finding himself at the ledge over and over and over again. Yeah, but James now kind of playing uh, James right now. He's turning it up nice. to another gear, gonna get up smash for his troubles, but look, the gap has closed significantly for him. He was down. Gap's closed. You know, I'm trying fair to buy bit. some shorts. Cargo shorts. <laughs> Way over here, man. We're, 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 we're fired. You're, we're voting you off the island now. Let's go. Koop's all alone on this island. Hold on. Solo cast, my man. Oh, this man. Is, dude, the rage low percent Mario combos are so cool and so dangerous, too. Like, you just gotta respect them a lot. You gotta, you gotta have the fear a little bit. The thing, too, like, I feel like conventional wisdom against Mario is you don't want to land on top of them, you know, from above. And I feel like James kind of been doing that in this game three. Ooh, uh, yeah. that was show, it yeah. show it off, man. You got it, show it off. Fuck, he just, he just up smashed. All right. There's a, try to parry that. You can actually, there's enough enough of a gap between the second to last hit and the last hit where you can parry the last hit. That still gets the job done though, so. And uh, even though, um, you know, Stu did mention that Howell, New Jersey is the Kramaside capital of the world, uh, that is not on the table now. James will die first if he tries to go for an upbeat Kramaside. Great combo right there from Wizzy, but he's gonna get spiked into the stage. <laughs> <laughs> Krom is concussed. My man's head is, is snapped Krom right now. Cussed. Oh, God. Speaking of being concussed, Mario's definitely feeling that one. Feeling Lan Lan <laughs> he, he's just like, gosh darn it, Krom. <laughs> he's got to swing where he can. He's managing to bring himself back in the depths from this. But sitting on James's counterpick as far as stages are concerned, this is still a dire situation for Wizzy because he's just barely scraping by with the skin of his teeth. Town City going to be the pick? All right. I like. I feel like Wizzy can actually move around this map very well. In the past, we've seen him maneuver around Town City well for the sake of camping out, getting his resources ready, reverting back to neutral because he's going to force a ton of approach with retreating aerials and fireball. Seeing how James is going to respond to that style of play and how he's going to control the stage, I think it's going to make this game flow a little more interesting. We're going to go to Town and City here for the counter pick. So not the small ceiling uh, haven it was in Smash Four. The stage is much different now. That could have been very bad for Wizzy. He's very fortunate James whipped that neutral beat. Nice. Okay, yeah, instead of trying to parry last hit, just turn around up B or regular up B if you didn't try to cross you up. So that was good by James. Good adjustment on, on that little part of the gameplay. So now Wizzy's like, all right, probably not going to down air as much. Because in that situation, like, you probably, yeah. after the throw, you probably go for a down air usually, but James has dealt with it well. So I think Wizzy's like, I'm going to mix it up, try to forward air or something. Yeah, it's a free 26%. There we go, to jab the wrong Oh my backhand. god! Yo, James is actually the town and city uh, platform master. Yeah. You remember that? For, remember when yeah. we played Void at Frostbite? He's just up B and everyone's like, oh, he's dead. And then you land on the platform like right as it slid in. But seriously, like a melee player in Randall, but oh my god. Oh, oh. hold on. Dead. <laughs> Imagine. <laughs> Imagine just this. <laughs> gonna take that horse down the whole town road. And that's Dude, he's gonna ride till he can't no more. Here we go, at the I ledge. I both of you. <laughs> they rotate you out for, for another pair. I gotta go. <laughs> All right, but James continuing to press right now. He smells blood in the water. Maybe trying to kind of press Wizzy, make him think a little bit quicker. Oh, God. Neutral getting up against the Krom is so brave. I can't believe he did that. I mean, you got to mix it up, obviously. Good. Nice up beat. No, never mind. It didn't get him anywhere, man. No, that's it. Hey, here we go. James up huge right now in this uh, fourth game, guys. So Wizzy's going to have to dig really deep, dig into that closet of, uh, of Mario costumes from Odyssey, <laughs> see which one is best suited. Uh, to make this comeback right Which one now. What do you think it would be from Odyssey? Uh, I'm the Safari frog suit. I'm a big fan of the uh, of the astronaut suit personally. Hard call. You think that would help against Crom? Like yeah. just the technological advantage? <laughs> or actually, the best one would be the invisible suit. Obviously, so. is it an invisible one? Uh, spoiler, oh, wow, spoiler. Sorry. Sorry. Wow, thanks a lot, man. <laughs> Damn, I gotta go. <laughs> you spoil a game that came out three years ago. <laughs> it's ridiculous. <laughs> You gotta vote yourself for that. Anyway, yeah, so let's see. Just don't get three stock. Wizzy, Wizzy trying to avoid three stock, yeah. And James, man, I love the way he's using the stage. You can see this is definitely the right counter pick. Like, yeah. No arguing that at this point. Uh, he <laughs> just air dodged out. You know, a lot of options in were, like happened in my mind right there. Air dodging that way was not one of them, I'll be honest. Oh, God. Yeah, oh, F man. And uh, three stock on deck as Shoyo James punches his ticket to Winner's Finals. Winner's Finals. Winner's Finals. 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 I was gonna say Winner's Side, but you know, it's kind of implied. Wow, that was amazing though, but we're gonna have oh, I'm gonna put my There's the winner of this set by a score of three to one and advancing Let's to winner's two. final show yo J so good. Element and his element. So Stu's gonna bring in the next uh, combatants for the other side of winner's semis, I believe. As the Stu in his natural habitat. Yeah. <laughs>
preys upon the unsuspecting. Yes, we need, we need Sylvanas Jersey. to make uh, a YouTube video. You know, he makes a smash like nature <laughs> videos. He needs to make one of Stu. That'd be dope. <laughs>